Förderer were some more factorial and sentient fries. So, as you can see, we are starting a new campaign in the Space Age expansion. We will probably not get to the Space Age content this stream, because that, well, requires launching a rocket, which will be quite a while until we get there, to be honest. Now, good friend of mine, Scream, will join us whenever he feels like, basically, on this playthrough. So, you can expect him to pop in basically any second now. Could take a couple minutes before he joins, could take like an hour or so. We will see. And we will welcome him when he does come. But first, we are obviously playing on a rail world because our trains. And yeah, that's pretty much the only reason why we are playing on a rail world. I basically always play on a rail world. We do have a couple of iron up north. Not a lot, not a lot at all. We will need to find a new one, definitely. And same with coal and copper. The stone will last us quite a bit, I think, but definitely we will need to find iron, coal and copper. How it's looking right now, I think I'm going to build the main bus southwards but let us get started on drilling the iron meetings although you need a lot of coal seeing as we did start in a desert but let's just mine that by hand for now we can at least get started on our drills. I get a little bit of a coal loop. But we do need stone to start on our burning drills. There is a biter nest northeast already. That we will need to deal with pretty much immediately. Did that. No, the stone did not drop any coal for us. That is a shame. Where's the... There's the... Oh, I need to press Alt key. Let's get drilling then. A little bit more coal, please. You can get started. You need to continue. You do still have some fuel left. I think we should be able to get at least a little bit of a coal. How do I pick you up again? What button was that again? It, not W. I thought it was... Did... Hang on. Interface. Is it interface? No. Controls. Pick up, pick up, pick up, pick up items off the ground. F, really, F. It might have changed it due to the expansion that is very possible. Or I might just be done. And forgetful, that also happens. So we got our little circle for coal going let us just continue making some more iron i do need some more stone though definitely a lot of stone might be my next drill to be honest because early on you do need a lot of just flat out stone. We do have one, but we don't currently have the coal for you yet. Neither do we have a chest for you. I could make a iron chest. 
We don't have a lot of trees. That that is that might be a problem early on. I think if I see on the minimap correctly, there are some down south. But I think I will start with an iron chest for the stone mine. Which I don't usually do. I usually start with wooden chest, but... When the need is high, you know. What's the saying in English? The devil ate flies or something? So my... Somehow I always thought it was the devil may drive. They might both be valid. I've heard it both ways. And let's get you going, thank you very much. I do need to put you in front of our burner drill. Which I do need to fuel up. <clears throat> I do need to ensure that you can get this kick started. Yep. There we go. Steam power finished. Oh! Wait, what? I think they changed the... the technology. We need to craft 10 copper plates to be able to craft electronic circuits. Oh. That is interesting. You want to make your unlimited? Probably not. Until you have like four stacks. I wonder if that's just early game? Where well, that's the case. Or if that will be the case on separate planets as well. Let's make four more burner drills. Craft iron for me. Now. We definitely fuel you up a bit more. You are also in need of a little bit more fuel. Let's place it there. And four more drills. I just put them side by side. I can easily refuel them. I'm going to need a little bit bigger of a burning drill circle. Not a bit bigger actually. And I need more stone. Thank you. Only 19. Quite a bit more, to be honest. Still two more, so we can expand that one. And let's fill you up. Now. Do we start on electricity? Probably we should. Well, I do need to improve my coal mine first. I do have the mines. I only want one in there. Alright, that is double our coal production. You need more coal to. No, you just need to go a bit more eastward. You have more stuff to drill into. Alright. Get you over here. And let us get, I think, a couple of copper mines straight into furnaces. 
just to get started on our electricity. They'll do very good things for us. Right. And actually get a couple more. Let's do three of them. Although we do not have enough fuel to keep going. So let's expand our... No, that uses up our stove furnaces. Yeah, we'll expand our coal circle first. Can I get one more? Thank you. And we'll still go with three... With three copper mines, I think. Let's juggle it like so. I think you did drop a single one of them. Yes, you did. Let's use that to kickstart it a little bit faster. There we go. Fill you up, fill you up. We'll use the rest to kickstart our copper mine. And there are some trees. I do need to shop some of you. Although I'll place my mines first. I'll place them a bit up more northwards. Thing as we will be mostly in that area. It's a little bit less moving around, you know. I'll place you over there. Thank you. Nothing we can mine. And I'm already missing my night vision for my previous playthrough. Which is pretty standard for a new start. There we go, we researched electronics. So, let us get started on some electricity meetings. Although we should get you some more fuel before we do so. I'll put the rest of this 20 coal into the stone mine, which wasn't running out yet, but still. Let's be prepared, you know. We'll pick up a little bit more. So we can generate some electricity. And maybe put a little bit... Pick up like half? No, I cannot. I need a offshore pump. I need two steam engines and a boiler. You won't need two steam engines, but we will definitely want quite a few. And a few more pipes as well. And... Yeah, sure, placing it right over here will do good things for us. This will be a... Belt. So our boiler will be over here. And we will have a column of steam going northwards. Now, do I want to place you a little bit more upwards? Honestly, it probably won't matter. Because by the time we have this, we have more than three steam columns like this. Then we will probably have bots already. So we will fix that when the time comes. I do want some cables. I want a lab. And I will want some automation. But we are crafting a lab, so we will get access to red technology 
Lambda Q is enabled. I think I do. Yes, yes, we do. Perfect. I do like playing with Q's enabled immediately. I don't really get why we wouldn't enable that immediately. Some domes. Some ways to get Q's after their first rocket, but I don't really get the appeal of that. We could get the light armor immediately. Do we do so? Oh, sweet. Good. We only need five. No, we then get science specs. Let's plop you down. Let's get some coal to refuel you. Is that a new achievement, really? I figured I had that ages ago, but apparently I did not. Good to know. I mean, I do have well over 100 hours in this game, and that's basically nothing compared to most players. I mean, I gotta have more than 100, but I don't know the exact number. We just need one more. There are a whole lot of side specs there. And, whoa. It used to be up until here, so there's five more side specs. I suppose one per planet. Yeah, that does kind of make sense. I wonder what all the new technologies will be. I know that there's now elevated train tracks. And that I'm excited for, because I do like trains, as I mentioned before. Now, we do need to refill our copper. And we will definitely take most of it. The pretty full stack we have. Well, three quarters of a full stack. It's good enough for the early game. Filled up. You need to be filled up. And I'll take all of that. Thank you. And soon we can get our first assembly machine. And by the time we arrive, we still need a little bit more. Do I craft a second lab? Hmm. It'll take forever to really do so. I think I'll just wait here a bit. Actually, let me get some fish while they can still spawn in this water. <laughs> it's not polluted forever. Right, assembly machine, thank you. Get a couple of those actually. But we'll start with one. That will be producing... What will you be producing? Probably gears. And we'll take... An inserter, definitely. The five of those. And we'll get some iron chest as well. Being as we will be... Very. We'll need to be very conservative with our wood. Not that we really need it for anything else than small cables, small power poles. But still, if we run out of small power poles without the ability to make mediums. We're pretty much screwed. Right, you're fully filled with coal. Don't have a lot left. Let me get a little bit more before I start filling up our electricity.
now. I think our first one will be making assembly machines. We need iron gears. We need iron plates itself. It's like two over here. Let's fill that up with iron plates. We'll be making assembly machines. And you will be making some electronic circuits for me. And you too will require some electronic circuits. Get a few more inserts manually. Right, you need copper wire instead of copper plates. Good. An assembly machine making copper plates. And perfect. Now we do need to place some iron over here to feed you. Some copper over here to feed this one. And you also need the same stuff as. The assembly machines. We'll probably make like 50 of those before we switch that over to inserters. But inserters are a bit easier to produce manually. You've run out. Let's plop you down over here. Fill you up. And the biters are already starting great. Not at all, because that will mean we will lose quite a bit of production. Well, not as much as I expected. And we don't have repair packs yet? Really? Hey Scheme, how are you doing? Yeah, it will be a desert spawn experience, so get in here. So we can get to space. Yeah, we don't have repair packs yet. Really? We need 25 of those, okay. I need to pick up the copper plates. Let's get that started, and we will start destroying that spawn. We might have enough. Yep, yep, that's gonna be a problem. Yeah, I did notice the new research mechanics. I mean, they're interesting. But I don't think it will have that much of an impact. It might with the new content, though, but early on... Not yet. Oh, is that a second spawner? What to target? You were me. Die, you boss. Oh, this is gonna take forever. I'm definitely researching military first with the desert spawn. And I just like mining. I thought it was C or something. Not T, that's research. How do I. I maybe right click it? No. Okay, do not have enough for this. Yeah, it probably won't make a massive difference. We don't have the. At least I don't have the massive blueprint book. Oh, there we go. That's how we mine. Is it 
actually faster than just shooting it with a handgun, I feel. Like, actually. Okay, you. And there goes the spy spawner. Yeah, that's why I will not import any blueprints from previous games. Because I feel the ratio will be completely messed up, or at least messed up significantly for a lot of them, that I just want to make new ones. That's also kind of the fun of stuff. Get out of here, you stupid beast. That was very well timed. My arrival, that is. I need a lot more firearms. Issues are generally fine. All right, then. Just different. Okay. Anyway, let me get started on the military so I can replace my stupid handgun with an actual gun. Still don't want to make two of those. I do want a little bit more. Yes. Get that in there. Got 16 assembly machines. Do I switch you over? Oh, that's something else. Do I switch you over? I think I do. I want some inserters for now. Oh no, I need to rotate that one. You need to take the copper out of the chest, not put the wire into it. Have I opened a lab interface? Yes, yes I do. Yes. Five more research stuff. We got two black ones, we got dark purple. We got yellowish green, orange and was that magenta? Reddish purple? Yeah. I Now I see what you meant with the sushi belt for science will be necessary. I'm still thinking, definitely requester chest. We will definitely use requester chest once we get to that point. Although they might just all arrive via space shuttles. So maybe we just take it directly out of the space sh shuttle instead of out of a belt. Uh, scream. I will ban you if you make a sushi belt for our science. So don't. Just use the request chest. But maybe I won't ban you, but still. I will be kinda salty if you do. Anyway, good military, you're working there, attacking my call again. Get out of here. Go on, get. Get Isaac. Oh, they pretty much killed all of it. I read it way too late. Now. I need copper plates. And I need to replace you, so it'll be like 10 of them. Crystal chest will give throughput issues though. I mean, not if you just have enough bolts. I'm pretty sure. And if you request enough of them for a buffer, <laughs> that means war. Well, yes, it does. Time to kill the bugs. We will exterminate the bugs. Definitely. But first, let me just replace all that we've lost. In fact, I'm gonna improve what we've lost. lost just to spite the bugs. Did I... Yes, build me a submachine gun. Mostly bot count issues, you mean? Eh, probably, but then we just need to upgrade the factory. Now, I... Don't need shotgun shells, I need firearm magazines. 
Thank you.